Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel and we are finally doing Red Dead Online. I'm going to be doing the story and also explore as well because I want to see what things I've actually added to the game after the actual main story. I am looking forward to this. Yeah, I've been meaning for a while to play this. I just haven't really had the time. But as I've been changing some of my schedules with some of the gameplay throughs and I've decided, you know what? I'm going to add this back in now. And it can be a regular feature. I'm not sure how much we're going to do after we've completed the story. Maybe I'll do videos here or there, depending on how you guys, like, whether or not you guys enjoy it. Like, if you guys enjoy the online, then I'll continue doing more videos. If you don't, then we'll just finish it after the story. There are games I've played since the last time I actually did this playthrough. And still this game is rated above basically all of them. Graphics are just absolutely ridiculously... It's, it's mad. Absolutely mad how... It's quite a few years old now. And still it's rated higher than the other games graphically. Storytelling wise, game will... It's just... Absolutely stunning game. Here we go. Here they are. Tell the marshal this ain't how we do things here. But I'll oblige him this once. All right. Let's see what we got. Okay, you head through there. To create our own character. I'm gonna need your details. Name. Yeah, appearance. Ah, oh, let's have a look. Randomize. You are going anywhere, and neither am I. Right. Okay, not bad. Not bad with the age. From what I hear, you ain't leaving us anytime soon. Body build now. Average. I call that blue. I can have a look. Bushy, thin, natural. Eyes and brows, carefree, neutral. Let's go with carefree. Uh, cheeks, gaunt, wide. <laughs> Cover small. Yeah, we'll keep that. That's actually quite funny. Haircut. Long, slick back, no. Oh, that's funny. A we'll so we could be like a crazy hairstyle. What's the craziest one? You're lucky you were caught, you know. The way the town feels about what happened, you were Bold. likely to be shot. Uh, hair colour. It's a process, all right, but a necessary one. How you doing with that? How you doing, lifestyle? 
Not mean what? Find Okay then. I don't wanna see what's different on this. I won't even not least spread course, patchy, rugged, dappled, yep. speckled, right, constant, uneven, spotted, minor, hearty, hearty, complexion, chaps, tipped, flushed, healthy glow. The pox. Oh, go to the Black Death. Plagued. Oh. Create a plagued, plagued character. Oh yeah, I'm definitely going to do like a scar down his eye. Freckles, no, flexion, no, no, no. Tired, yeah. He's tired. Tired, torn, scar. Smashed. Bloody smashed. Jeez, a bear. It was a bear. A bear attacked him. Scrapped. Broken. A uh, lion, he had a fight with a lion. Marred, raised, blemished, scalped. Scalped, bloody hell. Not slashed. Clawed, I like the claw one. Yeah, that'll do. Back, lifestyle, randomised all. No, 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 that's it, isn't it? Is that it? A whistle. Okay, we can create our own whistle. To all of them. No uh, missile. What happens if we put the whistle all the way up? Can we do like a high pitched one? What's this one? Oh, okay, how about this one. Star two. Three. Four. That needs to be higher. No, it's like a deeper one. There you go. Attributes: health, stamina, dead eye. Uh, stamina. Maybe I'll put. I mean, I've only got two points left at the moment. I could go health and stamina for now. Leave dead eye at the moment. And confirm. That's our character. Smile. I'm so looking forward to this. Play intro. Yeah, want another basics. I want to play the intro. Just because I want to see how it starts. Yeah, play intro. I don't want to skip it because I want to see what actually the story bit is. Plus, I haven't played it for ages. I wonder if we're going to find out how he ended up in prison. Some months later. We can make our own story. Penitentiary Malwink. Unless he tells us. Jackson! Officer Jackson, move those prisoners! Officer Benton! Kitchen's a staff! Officer Townsend, those rocks ain't gonna break themselves! What are you standing there for? Get moving! What are you looking at? Go on, get moving. You, you, you with the hammer, and you, you'll do. We need to perform a work detail out near Tumbleweed. Come on, get in. Open the gate. Come on, Milliken. Oh, I'm so hyped for this. I 
tell you what, old Jameson is a wretched, sour old bastard, and no mistake. You lot stay calm in there. You aren't saying nothing. Well, you are now. Shut up. You know, my wife has acquired ideas significantly above her station. She's been reading too many goddamn books. Personally, I'm against education. Of women, I mean. And men, I guess. Unnecessary. Doesn't add much to the world. Education. Good day, gentlemen. Oh. Don't do anything stupid. Nobody gets shot. Act like fools, and the pair of you will be dead within a minute. Now, what are your names? Jenkins and Milliken. Well, Mr. Jenkins and Mr. Milliken, throw your guns to the ground and get on down here. That's it. Very glad to meet you. It's not worth being rash. You boys get paid a salary. You get that salary whether these people escape or not. Your wives presumably want you alive. Let them out. Now, please. Okay. Okay. You all run away. Aside from you. Try to stay out of trouble. This is a stroke of good fortune for all of you. Use it. Now, Mr. Jenkins and Mr. Milliken. Be so kind as to uh, quickly run away before somebody gets shot entirely unnecessarily. Go on, don't look back. Very polite. Mr. Wendt, I believe it was fifty dollars we agreed on. It was. Here's fifty each. Each? Yes. Now get out of here, both of you. My employer and I appreciate your professionalism. All we did was stand there and look tough. And you did it fantastically well. Good day, gentlemen. Now, sir, how about you pick up these guns and we move out? My mistress is waiting for us. Who the hell are you? You don't want to hear my story? How I was locked up in jail? No, wait just a minute. I was locked up because I was having a fight with a badger. And scratch my face. Get on the horse when you're ready. Ready? Wonderful. I hope you'll forgive the secrecy. My employer particularly values discretion. My name is Mr. Horley, by the way. Six months at Sissica Penitentiary, awaiting a hanging for a murder you did not commit. Oh. Must have felt a whole lot longer, my friend. You still seem strong, though. I mean, doesn't look like breaking all those rocks has left you entirely broken, in body or in spirit. I hope I am right about that. Rounding you folks up, and those sham trials, they were a disgrace. Made a mockery of the rule of law. Still can't quite believe they got away with it. There's others convicted when you were. They came out breathing fire. Maybe you're like that too. Guess we'll see. Or maybe you just want to put it all behind you. Forget you were in there at all. That would be fine, of course. You will listen to my mistress first. She spent a good sum getting you folks out. You owe her an audience, at least. You're just up here. There's the camp. Get your horse. So at least we know why we were in prison then. So we, we didn't, it wasn't my backstory. That's just the backstory of how we got the scar. We was fighting a badger. So we were arrested for, well, falsely, oh, sorry mate. Falsely arrested for murder we didn't commit. This way. She's anxious to meet you. Madam, we're back. Hello. Jessica and the clerk, how do you do? What did you tell him? Nothing, as we discussed. Thank you, Hawley. I do hope we haven't inconvenienced you dreadfully. But seeing as you were due to be hanged in a week, I'm sure you don't object too strongly. I know you're innocent. Well, <laughs> not perhaps exactly innocent, but not guilty of what you were accused. I know you and those who were with you that died were little more than patsies, and that you were set up by one of three men or a woman, possibly by all of them. 
I can't be sure, but that is all I know so far. And one of these people also made Mrs. Leclerc a widow. And I will avenge my husband's death, so help me God. But I will not avenge it upon them who did not cause it, or caused it unwittingly. Anyway, I'm sure this is all a touch confusing and melodramatic. Oh, where my manners? Holy, please show our guests to their tent and give them some fresh clothes to put on. Very good, madam. Then serve us both a little refreshment. Certainly, madam. This way. You'll find a change of clothes in there. Alongside a few other items you might need. A lasso, a knife, and a lantern, I believe. Okay, let's see what we've got. Can't change that. Hats. We can change hats. No hat. Stalker hat. Western hat. Oh, oh my bloody heck, why on earth would we wear that? <laughs> Western. That's the best one. That's actually the best hat we got. Coat. What we got coat wise? Duster coat. Oh yes. I'm going with blue. I like the blue. What else we got? Vest. Uh, traditional vest. Outdoorsman vest. Might go with that one. So we go with that. Traditional. We go with the red. Shirt. Give it a blue. Suspenders. Oh yes. Definitely go with the suspenders. Let's do it. Don't want our trousers falling down, do we? Weapon equipment. And nothing really. Pants. Oh, yeah, we can change these. Studied pants, slack. Go studded. Blue. Boots. Here we go. Lumber boots, workman boots. Let's get lumber. Keep these ones. That's it. Yeah, exiting the wardrobe of finalize your starting clothes. Yes, we want to leave. We want to do it. That looks more comfortable. Holly? Here, madam. Your very good health. I suppose it beats dying, hmm? Mrs. Leclerc's husband was murdered by one of his business partners. And I intend to find out which one. Or rather, I intend for you to find out and kill them. You're the only person I could possibly trust to do whatever it takes. Because you and your accomplices, you're the only other victims of their lies still alive. See, you walked into the town at approximately the same time my husband was shot in the back, but by another gun, firing different bullets to those you possessed when you were arrested. These bullets, this was their mistake. You were rounded up and sentenced to death, all because you came to town and didn't talk too much and seemed like you were nasty. Anyway, here they are, the people who run Blackwater. Mr. Jeremiah Shaw, banker, real estate speculator, and crook. Mr. Amos Lansing, ranch owner, speculator, and crook. Mrs. Grace Lansing, his wife. Society patroness, lover of the arts. Crook, my former best friend. Teddy Brown, her disgraced brother, outlaw, wanted man, and still in contact with them. All I ask of you is your help in finding out quite what happened. Mrs. Leclerc would like to help you get back on your feet. Get back to work. Whatever your work may be, I don't judge. You want to rob? Rob. You want to save innocent folk? Do that as well. But you need me just as much as I need you. I think we all understand each other. I hope we do. Good. 
I look forward to rewarding you for killing those who made me a widow. My husband was a true believer in this country and in the West. He was killed for greed. Foul greed when there's quite enough for everybody. I don't care what your scruples are as to killing. I will take the full burden of that sin upon my shoulders. Goodbye, for now. Then Hawley, go introduce him to nice Mr. Cripps. I think you'll like Cripps well enough. He's long past his prime, of course, but uh, he hasn't gone entirely crazy just yet. And he will help you, better than most of his ilk. Cripps! Get up! Oh, hello, partner. Never oh, drunk. <laughs> this is your new boss. Oh, pleased to meet you, partner. Oh, cheers, mate. It's been on your end. At your service. We'll pay to get your camp established. Mrs. Leclerc is a generous benefactor. And, uh, where are we headed? Select camp and properties. Camp, camp location, small camp. Cap tooth ridge. That's any place we can pick right now. Oh, sir. While Cripps is establishing your camp, perhaps you can go to the station and see the clerk. Then head to see Clay Davies. He's a horse thief and uh, not a terribly nice one. Then meet Cripps back at your camp. See you shortly, boss. Good luck. The sooner you do it, the sooner we'll leave you to your own device. See that, dude? Go to Bendict Point train station, and we're away. Boom. Let's go to the train station, get a new... Are we going to get a new horse, maybe? Horse. Can we give our horse an apple? No? It's alright, horsey. Oh, look at the lighting on that. That is absolutely stunning. I've missed the music in this game as well. I think about this game just... Oh, yay, look at the train! No, don't go! Don't go! Come back! Please! Free roam mission, give us a K. Stay there, horsey. Or follow me, I don't care.
Oi, what are you going to do, mate? I've got a gun. Let's talk to this man in here. Hello there, post clerk. Hello, Mr. Postman. Hello. You must, uh... You must be a Harley's friend. He's one of us. He said you also were a discouraged man. I'm very discouraged. Disappointed Alton. That's me. Anyway, it's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. I find your reticence charming. Real charming. By the way, I heard you might want to earn a little money. Well, some gentlemen have been robbing our stages, and they are not part of the club, if you catch my meaning. If you can make them go away, I'm sure they will have something of interest to you. They're up near Gap Tooth Ridge. See what you can do, okay? Here, by the way, a catalog. The latest issue just came into this armpit from a land more civilized. And if all works out, well, my colleagues and I move around these stations as needed. And all of us are very discouraged. We will all help a fellow sufferer with pertinent information. Good afternoon, sir. My thank you. Go to Rio Bravo. Oh, hang on, hang on. There's a we could search some it there. Search the drawer. What's that? Take all of them cigarettes. Thank you. Those are mine now. Whether or not I use them. I tap over here. Another drawer. Loot. Oh, more cigarettes just lying around. That's my handgun. Okay, I'm just making sure I know how to do this again. Oh, there you yeah. Half fist. Got a knife. Oh, yeah, my lantern. It's dark in there. Just go on the go on the uh, train and just ride and ride and ride. But we're going with our horsey. Right, your movements people will be limited when your stamina core is empty. That's why what you're meant to do is give your horse something to eat, aren't you? So you give him an apple. I'm gonna get him something to eat. God, at least the trains are quite often, aren't they? That's like the second train within like a couple of minutes. Do, 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 I'm guessing the first thing we're going to be able to do, I bet that's a camp, isn't it? Where the smoke is. It's a camera. Over there. Yeah, it's over there, isn't it? Okay, it's a bit further away than I thought. I was going to just get off and fight. I get close enough to be able to get off my horse and then just go crazy at them. Search for the hideout. It's up there. I wonder if there's a pathway around here.
Search for the hider. There it is. Can I go in guns and blaze and just shoot all of them? I'm here to kill all you jerks. I do not come in peace. Here you going, mate? Run off. Don't run off, mate. I'm not gonna hurt you. I've just come to loot your stuff and tell you all to stop what you're doing. Don't worry, I'm not gonna kill you. I'm just injuring you all, okay? You're just injured, slightly injured. You'll be all right. Somebody else in there. One more person. All right, you jerk. Oh, there they. Come on, dude. That is him. Search the hideout. I'm going to search all the people I've killed. La 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 la. Let's pick you up and carry you over here. Because... I want everybody to realise what I've done. This entire pile of bodies over here is mine. Boom. Right now, let's search you. Loot. There's one over here, isn't there? Yeah, there's one. Got this more loot here? No. Okay, yeah, these are the ones I've already looted. The ones that are uh, darker are the ones we haven't actually done yet. Swap hat. Hat you got? It is black. No, I want to pick his body up. No, throw it, put it on the floor. Throw it. Yeah, just got that trash there. Hat. Swap. Let's have a look at your hat. Yeah, I'll take that. Thank you. Let's loot you. There's some more loot over here. Thank you. Thank you very much. Let's search the rest of this place okay okay you're good you're real good friend I kill him here take this the map just be kind don't kill me please tight map yeah I won't kill him Yep. I said, get out of here. Open satchel. Treasure map. Oh, okay. Oh, no way. That's where we are. That's us, isn't it? Corpses, our horses, and that's where the treasure is. Put a waypoint there. I'm still searching the camp first before I do anything else. Any other loot around here? That helps you bring the map up quicker. Okay. Alright, go get our horsey. Here 
Hey, Mouse, what's that? What are emotes? Emotes. Emote will. Cigarette wave. What's that smell? <laughs> it's the horse. God, I'm getting used to these buttons again. So I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Let's get out of here. Let's go and get the treasure. I'm so hyped for this game. I wonder what we're actually going to find treasure wise. Is it just going to be money? Or are we actually going to find some interesting items? That'd be cool if we do. miss the graphics of this game. I mean you play like big games and you look out into like the world and you're like it doesn't it doesn't feel like full of life. You see you can see it's a big game but it's not full. This game just feels full. It feels like it has life everywhere. What's wrong with you, mate? That's it. That was entirely my fault. Now watch where you're going next time. You jerk. Well, you all know it was my fault, Paul. We'll blame him. We're going to have our character as a clumsy oaf that blames everybody else for it. Rabbit, run away! Oh, sorry, Rabbit, we're, we're coming this way. We have to treasure. Oh, hang on, there's somebody already here. Oh, it's horses, it's alright. Wild horses. Hang on, here we go. So, Eagle Eye not only helps us with shooting people, it helps us find treasure. Ah, oh, that's it. Okay, it's not buried treasure. What we got? Take. Yes, please. Thank you. Ability card. Platinum earrings. Rank. Necklaces. Things for me to sell. And a lot of cartridges. Oh wow, okay, shop items will become unlocked as your rank increases. You can see your rank unlocks under progress in the pause menu screen. Uh, so you got, pro is it progress, yeah? Progress. Clubs, clothes, roles, awards, non-story, non-rank unlocks. So we got nothing at the moment. Absolutely nothing. Scrawny nag. Oh. I don't want to get rid of this horsey. We'll, rip, we'll keep you, scrawny nag. Weapon wheel. You the loadout. Oh, okay, so we can pick different. So we've got Deadeye. Select. 
we can pick a moment to recuperate while dead eye is active you slowly regenerate health taking any damage will cancel dead eye I might actually use that one original price is fifty dollars for another ability card focus fire while dead eye is active you and your team members deal a little more damage if more than one member of your team has this ability the effects do not stack so if someone else has it it doesn't really matter paint it black while dead eyes active paint targets on enemies fire your weapons to shoot all mark targets each shot drains dead that is really important i remember this in the main game i'm gonna go with the health one for now though just while we're not a strong character yeah i like that and we'll equip it and we can always go the next one we can always do three three more so i could always do a different one meet clay davis who's clay davis now when you're dead eye, okay, now dead eye, when aiming, press off feet and dead eye. Your dead eye bar will refill each enemy you kill. And will also receive health, which is what I kind of want anyway. So we got to go meet Clay Davis. It's a story mission. I do like the first person cam, it's so cool. So if they did a game where like the graphics look good with both first person and third person, usually the graphics will look better. For me personally, I I like first person for like the fact that it makes sometimes it makes the graphics a lot better because you can see things closer up. Oh, but I do prefer this game in the third person. Okay, how long have I got left on this first video? Okay, about 15 minutes or so. Did you live at that house? That is a nice house. Tumbleweed. Wow, that's a nice area. Can we live here? Right, yeah, what I wanted to do was I wanted to see if our camp was ready yet. Now, I'm guessing the camp will be ready once... Got the post office all over there. Look how big this map is, though. Absolutely ridiculous. This is just crazy. And we will be exploring all of it again. Definitely. Is this set after this the main story? During or before? Wonder if we'll find out. Oh, okay. How square to start matchmaking for the players? Press square to view this. Let's view, view the story missions. Holy suggests you go see Clay Davis a horse feed to learn the ins and outs of the horse rusting trade. One to four players. I don't even mind. I'd rather just put my own to be honest, but. Okay, we'll find players. And this on my own, but obviously when there's other players involved, it could be quite funny. I may need them though, especially if there's difficult uh, people to fight.
Okay, that's fine. Prefer team. Ready up. I'm ready. Again, <laughs> did Hortley send you, Pop? I'm Clay Davies. This is my brother, Clive. He don't talk. Maybe you two will get along better. <laughs> Maybe not. Listen, I heard you wanted to earn some money. So there's a gang of ne'er do wells. They are a bunch of degenerates, not good people. They're out at Raskeller Fork with a bunch of horses they stole from me. Well, that's a lie, but they stole them off a fella I was gonna steal them off of. <laughs> Maybe you could get them for me. You think you could do that for me, Pop? Oh, look. Here are your friends. Well, good. Meet me at the stable at Tumbleweed once you have the horse flesh. And I'll pay you good. Oh, and Pop poorly wanted me to remind you any decent work you can find, take it. But just try to stay out of trouble. Oh, and once you give me those horses, well, after that, we'll talk again. Oh, I do so enjoy these conversations. I'm used to them on account of my brother. Let's go, Clive. Let's go, Clive, indeed. I gotta go to the outpost. Let's get a scrawny nag. Right, we gotta go and get some horses back. No. So this is really our first it's the first proper story mission, isn't it? This we're gonna be, it looks like we're going to be helping them guys a lot more than jump to horse. Or so we could just kidnap the person's horse. Why would we do that? All right, at least we're going to go up with this guy to get rid of these bad people who've stolen the horse and we're going to steal them f for these people enemies hello there Shot him then, why didn't he die? There you are, you're dead now, mate. No request for the Undertaker. Some of, somebody else at there. He's fighting them, I'm gonna go steal a horse. So there's just bad guys over here as well, but I don't think there is, is there? There's one over there.
I'm looting him. I'm gonna loot these people before I steal the horse. Loot. Thank you. Let's go and loot the others, and then we'll steal a horse. Steal a horsey, steal a horsey, do 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 do. Now for guys, they're not the other one doing. Cartridges. Well, I'm gonna get to the horse now. Looks like we're stealing you. Deliver the horse to the stable. I bet my own horse. A horse has been delivered. Leave me alone, you buggers! It's my horsey now. Oh, come on, dude, I shot you. How many times I shot you then? Oh, crap, 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 crap. Wrong way, wrong way, wrong way. This way, quick. Of the horse that's stable. I should use my rifle on this jerk. That's it. Get away from me, you jerks. I think we think we've got away with this one. the money you earn. Now listen, Horley came by and gave me a message. He said to go see your friend Cripps up at your camp. Now listen to me for a second. Any other decent horses you find, we'll buy it. Just as soon as we are set up, okay? Nice meeting you. You know what? Hold on, boy. I call him boy because I'm older. 30 minutes, he went black. <laughs> Let's give our friend here back the horse. It's yours. A sign of faith and future business. If you want to buy any extras or sundries for the animal, head inside. They've got a lot available. See you soon. <laughs> Come on, Clyde. <laughs> He's like, what? That's our horse that we started. Oh, so my old horse is gone. Oh, okay. We've got a new horse. So our rank's gone up. Horses. Tack and services. Services. Rename. We can't we rename him. Let's call him. Let's call him Barry the Horse. Barry. Health insurance. What's this? Barry. 
buy health horse insurance and we'll buy the we'll buy that as well there we go saddles that one there we go we'll have this one So what do you got him, yeah? Bed roll. So what do you got? Yeah, it's fine. Absolutely fine. It's got everything. Lantern? You know, no lantern. Yes, I do. I'll have a lantern. Oh, I can't get one of them yet. It's fine. That's it. That's everything. Right, we're finishing our first video here, guys. In the next one, we will go meet Crips at the camp. I'm looking forward to it. So, guys, thank you all for watching, and until next time, take care.